And maybe I need the Tombow right here so I can get through that. Now, see, it's tempting with the Tombow to go ahead and start creating all these little uh, hairs going all different directions, but I, I almost guarantee you, you're not going to want but a fraction of those in there. It'll look so much better and cleaner and less confusing, and you'll be able to, you know, have these uh, ribbons of uh, hair become a real advantage to you, uh, and you can keep that style instead of hoping that somebody understands what you're doing when you have all that fuzzy confusion in the uh, in the wrong places. Now again, some of these are going to be too light, but what we're going to do is brush it again. And then we can go ahead and, and uh, fine tune the highlights and continue adding maybe something past as we clarify some of these things. But I like the, uh, yeah, unless you can land and uh, take off, I really like the kneaded eraser for much of this because it has such a soft uh, transition. You can be too abrupt with it as well. You got to get that landing down. Just think of that. Let's see how many of these can we do. We've got this one. This is pretty bright. Maybe I'll brighten that one up just a little bit. And just to uh, reinforce what I'm talking about with uh, brushing it, remember, I can hold the darks and lights, at least as how they compare to each other, quite well if I brush this. This is another thing. You can do this with textures. I don't like to do it with a smooth uh, surface unless it's maybe metal or something. I might, but uh, I like the subtle texture. I, I just swear by the fact that well, you know, in a good way, swear. I, I just am convinced that uh, the uh, texture is picked up in our brains. Uh, and so when I do this, though, even though it still appears to keep everything uh, in, uh, in relationship to something else, uh, it may be lighter and something may be darker, I still now have cast in some of that value, even though I still see the lights and the darks. And I can come in here and now pinpoint something a little better. I can always take out a little brighter place uh, because I brushed that value in there. And I don't have to open up as much as I might have before. So I'll just keep getting more and more refined. That little uh, detail, the apex of the curve, I can fine tune that a little better. But it, it just doesn't work. Uh, unless you guys are just incredibly uh, talented beyond my uh, imagination here, uh, most of the time you're not going to want to uh, have to draw in all that value. It's such a wonderful thing not to have to draw uh, any more than is necessary. Yeah. And I'm not saying we're not going to draw, but I'm just saying it's you can't demonstrate everything with a line. It's just it. Yeah, let's go over here and see if we can get this. I'm going to try and brush this a little bit more too. 